The exams are here now. Um, stay positive. You can do this. Okay. Last few words of advice. Now, just remember, there's only two types of grade available. There's one you're happy with and one you're not so happy with. And the reasons why you'll be happy or not happy in August will be because you know you've either tried your best or you haven't. So just stay positive, work really hard over these three weeks. Remember, you're gonna have an amazing summer coming up. Make sure you know the skills you're gonna be assessed on. Your revision guides will tell you what you need to remember and what you need to be able to do in the exam. One of my best tips would be to make yourself a sheet of paper with everything you're gonna to need to remember into that exam. Take it with you on the day, read it just before, and put it in the bin on the way into the exam. In the exam, take your time, and make sure if you do get extra time at the end that you read through, and in physics especially, do the calculations again. Do the rearranging again. Check if I put these two numbers back into the equation, do I get the result that I should have? Even rounding, units, everything, all those little marks. Make sure that you do really read the question carefully and reread it after you've answered to check you've done everything that you should have done and you've used all the information that you should have been. Look out for those little clues to tell you what type of answer they're expecting. Just a few words they've chucked in here or there that aren't on every question that tell you how this one is different to other questions you've maybe done. I hope you've found my videos useful. My aim here at Kubelik Physics is to increase people's understanding so they gain in confidence with the physics, start to really enjoy it, and then do better in those exams. Now if I have been helpful, maybe you can help me out by sharing uh, and sharing maybe with the next generation of GCSE students or maybe you yourself are going on to A-level and maybe I, um, I can help you out with that there.